Hello, welcome to the stream. Today we are going to be playing Air Fortress on the Nintendo Entertainment System. I am excited. This is a random one. This might appear to be a very random choice. And it is a bit of a random choice. But um, a few streams ago when Mike and I did a NES variety stream, someone kept suggesting Air Fortress. And... I was like, why? Okay, and then we played it, and then I was like, you know what? I'm kind of into this. So let's dedicate a full stream to Air Fortress. <laughs> so if you're if you were the person suggesting the game and you're in here tonight, I hope you are happy. Alright, let's try this again. Okay, so this is Air Fortress. I am using a turbo controller because I gotta, or else my hands will be destroyed. Hello, Mr. Shig. All right, so we're a little dude riding on a rocket, and I'm gonna be on the lookout for background boulders that are not in the background, and they're actually in the foreground and can kill you. Castlevania Legends is your favorite Castlevania Game Boy game, really. I didn't- I wanted to like that one because I thought it was cool. That's like, oh, there's a girl protagonist, girl Belmont, and um... And it started off kind of interesting, like I remember the enemies being kind of funny. And uh... I just quickly was like, oh, I, I don't like this. Belmont's Revenge is the only Castlevania Game Boy game that I kind of like. But that's being very generous with the word like. <laughs> I think it's fine, I guess I should say. Another thing about this game that appeals to me is like the random 3D looking graphics. It's just, I don't know, it's funny. Oh god. Alright, we need to make it all the way to the right so we can go into the other area. Oh, are we doing that now? Yeah, it's, it took control. I'm not controlling it. It is now doing what it wants. And I think now we are just gonna be a little guy going up and down in the gra in zero gravity. Thank you so much, Drawn Unicycle, for subscribing for seven months. Thank you. Good to see you in here. I've been good. What are you guys saying? I have glasses like Smithers from The Simpsons. Now that's a new one. I haven't heard that one yet. And I don't know whether to take that as a compliment or not, but that's fine. <laughs> great game until level 7, 8. Are you talking about this game like it's great until level 7? Hello, Photon. I played way too many NES games. Me too. Isn't it fun though? <laughs> it makes my brain go kind of crazy. Hello Breakpoint. Thank you Robin Hood Gaming, I hope you are too. Alright, so this is what I was talking about. So now we are just floating. Okay, so, okay, so A shoots and then, so see how it says B in the upper left hand corner? I don't know if what that means exactly, but those are limited. I would say bombs, but they don't really seem like bombs, but I guess I'm gonna call them bombs because what else would they be? Alright, so I gotta try to not get hit. I'm gonna get hit. Oh, well, maybe not. Hey, didn't get hit. Oh, got hit. <laughs> like twice. And when you use the projectile, you kind of get like propelled backwards. Hey, Wolfmaster! I need to play more NES and very inexperienced on this system. My Wii has the emulator though and the mini console controllers work perfectly with it. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, check it out which, however way you can, but the NES does have some really good games. It also has some really bad games, but that's with any console, I guess. I'm really worried we're gonna get to a point in this game where I just like get stuck and then I'm gonna be like, oh, why did I choose this for a full stream? But you know what, maybe it will go fine. Maybe I can conquer the Air Fortress. Ah! 
Can't tell if it got me or not. I don't think it did. All right, so now we're going over to this little area. It will be fine. <laughs> Thank you. I need you guys know me. I need my constant reassurance. Wait, no, I didn't want to go down. And we got these space butterflies that look gigantic chasing us. It's gonna get me. <sighs> Yay, we got it. <laughs> that was tricky. Yay, got it again. Wah. Is this stressful? No, actually this is not yet stressful, but we'll see what happens. I'm sure it will be. Hello, Unbreakable Pixel. Good to see you in here. Eh. There we go. See, I'm trying to save the bombs for things that I should use the bombs on and not use bombs on little enemies since it is limited. I mean, we have 18, but I feel like later it's gonna be, it's gonna be hard to get more. I remember this taking a lot of hits. Okay, so it only took two of the big ones. Now it's very quiet. This game is very fun. It does ramp up a bit though. Okay. Oh. Oh, we got our little rocket back. There we go. We're zooming. He looks, he reminds me of like the Cheezosaurus Rex when he looks like that. He looks like the macaroni and cheese color. Thanks for hanging out, shiny 8-bit. We are now approaching the second air fortress. We are going to go to all of the air fortresses. Thank you, I almost called you Cyber Wolf. <laughs> Thank you, Wolf Master. Oh my God, what is wrong with me? Imagine if your name was Cyber Wolf though, that'd be, that'd be pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. Like you could be a hacker in a 90s movie. Wait, am I going back? No, this is different. For a minute, I thought, shit. I thought we were repeating, oh, uh, the first level again, and I was a little concerned. I think we're okay. I'm not gonna try to get that E up there. It's just gonna. Ah. So many rockets. Oh my god. Well, that's an interesting movement. Are they gonna come back? I wonder if you can blow up those giant- everything looks like cheese to me now. Are those giant clusters of powdered cheese? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Eh. Damn it. I wanted to get that bomb. Ooh, what was that? I've never seen that before. I think we're invincible because we're blinking. I don't want to test it because what if we're not? Well, it's over anyway. This game is so cute, hidden little gem. Well, I'm glad that the people that have played it seem to like it. So I think I made a good choice tonight with Air Fortress. Have you found any Game Gear games you would want to play stream? I have. I want to play Tempo Junior. Um, I want to play Alien Syndrome. I want to play the Dynamite Heady Game Gear game. It's been a long time since I've tried the Genesis version, so I don't know how similar it is. But from what I remember, I think it was a little different, so maybe I'll check that out. But I'll check out a playthrough of the Genesis version first. Because if it's exactly the same, then I would just do the Genesis version. Um, I have it written down, actually. I thought I did. I have, like, papers all over. Um... Oh, I liked Jurassic Park. I forgot about Jurassic Park on Game Gear. I wrote that down. Um, and then Devilish. That was another one that I liked. So yeah, there was a few. But so Tempo Jr. 
There's also Tempo on 32X, which I need to add 32X games to my mister because I want to play that. And then I think someone on Twitter told me there's one on Saturn also. Because I thought there was only the Game Gear one and the 32X one, but I guess there's also a third one. So that's kind of cool. Hey, Sergio, I'm good. How are you? Hello, Nostartia. All right, so now where are we? Thank you, Sankara Stones, for subscribing for 18 months. Thank you so much. It might be a little embarrassing getting your Air Force just blown up by someone wearing a banana spacesuit. See, now he does look less like mac and cheese and more like a banana. Who would you rather have blow up your Air Fortress? The mac and cheese suit or the banana suit? I feel like the mac and cheese looking one would be more embarrassing. So I tap up on the D-pad to hover. Ugh. I have no idea what continues are like in this game. I don't know, so we'll see how far we get. Oh, I'm so nervous. I see. I don't want to get slammed into the pink electric, electrocuted looking things. Electrical, I mean, <laughs> looking things. They look like they'll zap you. Oof. Ah! We're doing this. Oh my god, what's gonna what's gonna happen? <laughs> I don't know. Did I get hit there? I can't tell if I got hit there or not. Oh, and I saw we got some uh, subscribers. I will look in one second. Shit. Oh my god, why isn't it going? Oh, so those pink things on the bottom suck you down. Cause I was like, how come I'm not going up? That's scary. Thank you so much, Classic Mike Cade, for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. Um, what were you streaming? And thank you, Junior Dax, for subscribing for 11 months. Thank you. So yeah, we're playing Air Fortress, so if that sounds fun, then please stick around. Hello, Deadhead. And thank you, Wolfmaster, for shouting out, uh, oh shit. <sighs> Not shouting out, oh shit, but shouting out Classic Mike Cade. He does retro streams as well. Uh. Oh, can these gray things, like, nope, okay, so you can't go through the gray ones. See, we're taking some damage, but I don't really know if it's, like, how bad it is. Guess we'll find out. Now we're going down. You were playing NES Blaster Master? That's cool. Blaster Master is a game I never have fully gotten into and I feel like there's something wrong with me because so many people love that game. But I, I don't know. Ah! Oh, we still got hit by the projectile anyway. That's the worst when you kill the enemy and, and then you still get hit by their phantom projectile. <laughs> hey, Super Jeff, what's up? Hello, Moonwasher. Ah! Wolfmaster says it's a great game. Finally beat it a couple years ago. That's cool. Yeah, um, and then I tried the second, the Blaster Master game on Switch. And I couldn't get into that one either, but I don't know, maybe I'll give it another shot someday. Blaster Master just looks overwhelming. I mean, from what I remember, yeah, I could see that. Because you gotta, like, get out of the vehicle sometimes, and then you gotta find find it again. I don't know. That's, <laughs> that's my... <laughs> That's my uh, d uh, explanation of Blaster Master. I'm sure it's not accurate at all. Speaking of Sunsoft, have you seen the new Euphoria game? Looks easier than the NES version, but it's actually cool it got made. Um, the new one. 
I've been hearing, I feel like I've been hearing about Euphoria lately, but I thought it was just like a remaster, but it's an actual new Euphoria game. I didn't know that. I've, I like the um, first one, which I played. I think I streamed it, um, but I would definitely check that out. Oh my God, we're getting hit by everything. Oh shit. Hold on, oh God, oh God. Let's get out of here. Oh my God. All right, so we got hit a lot there. That wasn't that good, but what are you gonna do? Fuck. No! Oh, they like follow you around. This is not a good situation for me to be in. Oh God. Yeah, give me energy, please. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Go up there, go up there. We must get to the next fortress. Oh, do we like choose a way to go? What if I chose the wrong one? Hello, jump six. All right. Oh! Well, how am I supposed to- Oh. Duh, Aaron. That was dumb. Going up. I bet a lot of the thought of this as a better version of Metroid. It had a lot of detractors long ago what this doesn't feel anything like metroid to me did, did people really combine the two or am i misunderstanding the seat <laughs> that's crazy uh oh no oh did not mean to use a bomb but i did so we need to get some more bombs I need some more everything because I've been getting hit a lot here, so oh god. But I need a bomb for here. Ah, ah. Oh no, not another one. Shit. If there's another one, I'm gonna try to just use regular pew pew pews on it. Oh my god, there's another one! <gasps> no, we died! Where is it gonna start me? Game over! Password. I need a pen. I need a pen. I A T A. Damn it. Dan Goblin says, this is a game I had growing up as a kid when I was about seven. It gets really hard trying to escape the fortresses in later levels. Uh-oh. Well, we'll see how far I get. Dig Dug and Samus had a baby. <laughs> I, I could kind of see that. The password was almost Instagram. Oh, like Insta. <laughs> All right, continue. Oh, I guess I don't have to enter that in. All right, so we gotta start from the very beginning and I need my blanket. You get unlimited continues? Oh, good. That's good to know, right? Cause I was wondering about that. I like these little spiral things. Oh god. Oh! No! Oh, it's that plus. Oh, that killed me? I thought it... Alright, well, we already got killed twice. Should I just start over? No, I won't start over. We'll keep going.
cheese clusters. So I'm gonna call this guy right here Cheese Man. He's the Cheese Man. Remember on the Eric Andre show? They had the Daft Punk cheese guy. I forgot what his name was. It was, he would shoot like cheese. It was so gross, <laughs> but it was great. Hello, Flute Wizard. Happy March to you, too. Good to see you in here. Oh, Craft Punk. That's right. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, Kenshin. And hello, Yuki. Alright, so let's try this again. That that was a mess. That was a messy start at level... At Fortress, too. So let's try it again. I need, I need this. Uh, a lot of, a lot of tight squeezes here. Oh god, oh god, oh no. Yeah, we got it. We got it anyway. Can you blow these up? Nope. Gotta love a good pun. Exactly. Uh, craft punk. Still don't know. Does anybody know what that plus does? It's the second time I've gotten it, and I don't know what it does. Something just fell into my eye. Was it hair? Please don't be an eyelash. That's the worst when you get an eyelash stuck in your eye. Ugh. Ooh, that was close. Mike said you were screaming and your scream reached his stream. Did I scream on this stream? I might have. That's funny though, that now he heard me. Usually it's the other way around. Just pull the top eyelid over the eye and it'll pop out. Oh God, no. I remember kids used to do that in elementary school, like flip their eyelids inside out. That was the worst, that was the worst thing to look at. I don't think I screamed. Now we got our little craft punk guy going around here. Go in there. Go up. Hello, Ryu. How's Josephine? We haven't seen her in a while. Which makes me very happy because I don't like it when she comes around. It's scary, you know, having a ghost on your ceiling. It's not all fun and games. <laughs> Do I remember a restaurant called Ponderosa? I've heard of Ponderosa's Steakhouse, but I've never been to one. That made me laugh. That was, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that question. But we often talk about vacant retail and stuff on this stream, so it makes sense. Um, we could do defunct restaurant chains next. We could talk about that. There's still a few Sizzlers left. I was gonna say Sizzler, but there's still technically a few left, but not nearly as many as there were back in the day. Coco's. What other restaurant chains aren't around anymore? I thought TGI Fridays totally went out, but I guess they still are around in like, like I think the one by Knott's Berry Farm is still around. <laughs> Hello, PSN. 
Top 10 games that came with food. Why were some were some games packaged with food? It's oh my god, oh my god, no, we're getting hit. Ruby Tuesdays? I think Ruby Tuesdays is totally gone. Yeah, checks quest. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, there's still a Ruby Tuesday by you? Okay, I thought they were all gone. Chi Chi's? I've never been to one, but, um, yeah, I heard, I've heard of that chain. But I guess they're gone now, too. Friendlies is gone? The entire Friendlies chain is gone? See, we didn't have that on the West Coast, so when I went to the East Coast, I only had it once. And it was great! And then it went out, and I thought it was just that location that went out. <laughs> that sucks. Chi Chi's is gone, yeah. How about Golden Corral? I've never been to a Golden Corral, but I think they still exist. Remember Hometown Buffet? It was awful. Fuddruckers! I've been to a Fuddruckers once, years ago. Perkins? Oh my god, I forgot about Perkins. When me and my parents took a took a, I almost said field trip, took a road trip to the Midwest in like 2003. There were so many Perkins. We had so much Perkins. Cause there was always a Perkins everywhere we were. So we ate a lot of Perkins. That was probably the last time I ever had a Perk, I've ever had Perkins. <laughs> Thank you Dan Evil Robot for subscribing for 41 months. Thank you. Toasted honey bun at Perkins? They have toasted honey buns? <gasps> okay, so Perkins isn't gone. Well, thank God. We, we can't not have Perkins in society. Cinnabon is still around, thankfully. I love Cinnabon so much. It is so good. I need to pay attention. Ah. Applebee's is still around. If Cinnabon, if Cinnabon dies, I do too. Yeah, I don't... They're like one of the last things that are successful in malls, so they should never go away. It's rare that I actually get myself a Cinnabon, but when I do, it's like, I'm always like, this is a great decision. <laughs> Shit. Okay, this part, this part fucks me up. Oh god, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. You were wrong about friendly. Okay, so only some clothes. Oh, shit. the center of the roll cup they have and three of them are in there. Are you talking about Cinnabon? They have that where it's just the middle of the Cinnabon? That's crazy. I like the whole thing though. I like the whole experience of getting a Cinnabon. You need the outside too. I feel like that would be too rich, but it's probably great. I probably have no idea what I'm talking about. It's probably amazing. Come on, go up. We were naming chain restaurants that aren't around anymore. But yeah, Sabaro is still around. 
All right, so we went to the right. Let's go to, mm, I guess we'll go to the right again, because what if the left one takes you back? I'm gonna go to the right. Showbiz Pizza. I never experienced Showbiz Pizza, but um, they were taken over by Chuck E. Cheese, right? It was a little before my time. Because when I was a kid, it was all Chuck E. Cheese. Those stupid butterflies! Get off me! Okay, I just need to use a bomb there. Fuck. I wish she had a health bar. So I have like no idea how I'm doing. Oh god. Oh yeah, there's the other guy. No! We died in the same exact place! Howard Johnson. I've never been to one before. I have had Jack in the Box because I grew up in the LA area. Macaroni Grill, oh my god, I haven't thought about that in years. Yeah, there's Howard Johnson the Hotel, but there was also a, um, a, uh, restaurant. had this as a kid love it despite it being hard you gotta treat the air fortress like the death star destroy the main part of it and get out before it explodes that's a good way to look at it and hello midnight snowman all right so let's try not to fuck it up this time i gotta pay attention This part isn't too bad, but it's the later part of this level that drives me crazy. Shit! Hey, Larry76, I'm good, good to see you in here. Ugh. Oh god. Those CD things, they come and go so fast you can never shoot them fast enough. Well, that wasn't good. Should I just die? We already died twice, I'm gonna die. because we can't, no, no. We wouldn't have gotten anywhere. Orange Julius. I think Dairy Queen served the Orange Julius drink now. I don't know if all of them do, but a lot of them do. not gonna go for those because I always get slammed into a thing.
So I think that means we're invincible. Invincible. Oh god. I'm afraid to get up there. That looks way too difficult. I mean, I could do this. Kind of cheat it. <laughs> it worked. Thank you so much, Larry76, for the bits. Thank you. Hey, Hex. It's going. Everyone's talking about the food places. Shake Shack. Shake Shack's good. I like their fries because I like crinkle cut fries and they're always really crispy. So I, I like their, I like going there. I haven't had it a lot. I've had it only like three times, but it's pretty good. Oh my gosh. Five guys. I saw on Twitter somebody posted their receipt and it was just like a burger and fries for one person. And it was like $24 or $28. I was like, oh my goodness. I don't really like Five Guys. I don't know. East Coast needs in and out. I do miss in and out. Shit, 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 shit. Hello, Shinobi Soup. Okay, I'm just gonna try to pass all these. Oh, I need that, I need that, I need that. Do you eat any popsicles? <laughs> yes, every once in a while I'll eat a popsicle. I like the ones with the jokes on the sticks. Scooby-Doo push-ups are really good. They still make push-ups. I used to love the push-up pops, the Flintstones ones. I miss those. Those are so good. Do they taste like those? I'll have to look for those. Alright, so I think the next part coming up is where I have trouble. Mm. 
this part. Hello, Zoku. Okay, I think it's maybe it's the part coming up. It's like it's all blending together. No. Hello, Zero. Shit, I didn't do that right. No! Let me go! Well, we screwed that up. Why can't I do this? Oh, do I go like... No? I forgot how I did this. Yeah, like that. Okay, I don't know why I was having trouble with that. Oh well got hit a lot there so we're probably totally screwed Mike's losing viewers to Aaron <laughs> I doubt it oh did not mean to use a bomb there but I did well, we're gonna have to live with that decision fucking butterflies. There we go. Okay, we did it. We did it. Maybe. This could still go horribly. I thought it was over. I didn't know there was going to be more. Alright. At least we made it a little farther. Are we out of this air fortress? Are we now in the third air fortress? Well, there are only one way to find out. Uh-oh, we just got a big raid. Thank you so much, Mike, for the raid. Hope your stream was fun. We're currently playing Air Fortress on the NES. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. This shit's getting real. And I'm very scared. Oh no, not those things. Go up. Okay. This is intense. This music kind of, now I get the Metroid comments. Earlier I was like, why are people calling this a Metroid knockoff? And now I'm like, ah, okay. Thank you so much, ZD Patrol, for gifting a sub to Yuki Master. Thank you so much. Hello, Todd. All right, so we're here again. This looks, this is exactly the same as one part that we just did. Don't tell me I have to do that part again that was kicking my ass. Oh, fuck, I was a little too slow. We got hit. <gasps> Thank you so much, anonymous user. Ooh, how mysterious. You gifted five subs to Star Puffer, Bash Attack, L Pennington, Pikachu, and Statman. So if you got a gift sub from Mr. Anonymous, please tell him thank you. I appreciate that. That's very nice of you. Uh-oh. Oh god, the lights are going out. Oh no. Something's gonna blow up. Will we make it out of Air Fortress 2 at the right time? In time, I mean. I don't know. Oh, this little bastard's back. We almost did it! I am so upset. I didn't know Air 
fortress is gonna be this much of a struggle, but we must try it again. Do I like any Pokemon? Bulbasaur is my favorite. This game gets hard. Yeah, we're not even at level seven. I know someone said it doesn't get hard to level seven. This is level two. And it's kicking my ass. This The first part of level two is not bad at all, but it's just really long. I think that's the problem. Is this top 40 hardest on NES? I don't, I don't know about that, is it? It didn't seem like it would be, but you never know. Thank you so much, Joey Redballs, for subscribing for 18 months, and congratulations on your podcast. Oh, oh shit, I was looking at a chat and I ran into the cheese ball. And some NES have one very hard part. Oh yeah, like the entire game's not bad, it's just like one part, yeah. Well, I'm just gonna die because we can't die that early. It's gonna go into the cheese. All right, now let's start over for real. Death by cheesy poof. All right. Let's try this again. The second air fortress needs to be con con conquered. <laughs> Ugh. Stop following me. Hello, Nina Star. I've had space ice cream before and it looked nothing like that. Why was there was there something that looked like ice cream? I remember space ice cream. I like it. It's just like dehydrated Neapolitan looking powder. It's not powdery. I don't know, but I like it. If you could change anything about Twitch, what would it be? Uh, the first thing that comes to mind is it'd be nice if there were more categories. Like, instead of just retro, if you could have, like, consoles. You know what I mean? Like, or like an indie games category. Because, for example, I'm probably gonna play, like, um... SHIT! I'm probably gonna play Bloodstained Ritual Tonight, and it's like... You, if you put it under that category, probably not a lot of people are gonna find you unless it's a really popular game a lot of people are playing. So it's like it makes me want to put it in retro because it's retro inspired even though it's not a retro game. It's like, I mean yeah the tags help, but when it comes to like browsing, I don't know. It's just like I wish there was more categories to stream under. Just put in a retro, what's the problem? That's true. And then some people will be like, this isn't a retro game, and it's like, no shit. But it's retro inspired, so deal with it. <laughs> That's probably what I'm gonna say. Now we're entering the Air Fortress. Aaron's answer was 30 seconds, Mike's answer would be 30 minutes. <laughs> They'll just be banned if they complain. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I mean, there's probably more stuff I would change about Twitch, but I can't. That was just the first thing that came to mind. Thank you. 
got down that. Da, 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 da. See, okay, so this isn't the part that's bad. It's just the part. Towards the end of this level. And then when the lights started going out and everything, and we basically had to redo that part again. That was crazy. This stage gets crazy. My proudest recent accomplishment had to be my Deathless Bionic Commando run last week. Well, that's awesome. Congrats on that. I've never played Bionic Commando because every time I would try, I just felt the controls were really awkward to get used to. But I know people really like it, so it makes me want to try it again at some point. The game looks great for being on the NES. Yeah, I think it's a good looking game. Ooh, we, we missed the taking a hit on those pink things that time. Yeah, I like the music. Okay. We go over here. We're just gonna go past these guys. And I'm gonna get that energy. So we need all the help we can get. So I know earlier I said I, I wish there was a health bar, but I guess you just... <sighs> Sorry, pay attention to your energy meter. And then if it gets below 100, then you're in trouble, is what I think the deal is. I prefer NES Contra than Arcade Contra any day. Yeah, Arcade Contra is weird. I definitely like the NES version a lot better. I wish you could kill this thing, but you can't. Many projectiles! Hello Skywalker Ranch! They haven't been great this week, but I'm using a turbo controller and so far so good. Wow, we got hit a lot right there. That wasn't good. That was not good. Okay, go over here. Maybe I should kill this one too. There's just a few less things going around. Yes, I'm using a turbo controller because I would not be able to do this without it because it would it's a tap 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 tap. Not yet, Skywalker. All right, so I'm going to go here and then here. And then we did it! Yay! Last time I screwed that part up, even though I- It's like I knew what I knew- I knew what I had to do, but it didn't- My brain just totally... lapsed. <sighs> Alright, take my time here. No projectiles or anything, so no excuse for me to get hurt here. Ah. Ah. Oh, yay. Fuck. 
Those things project stuff so fast. I'm saying the word project and projectile a lot, but I mean, that's all that's going on here. Projectiles everywhere. And they're all going straight to my stupid helmet face. Getting destroyed. And this little asshole. Yeah, that's right. Who even is that guy? Oh, we just took so many hits. Shit, I need energy. <gasps> I don't have any more bombs! This is gonna take forever. We're gonna die! Wait, so I can sit? My energy goes up? Wait, I'm confused. Don't totally get it. So I guess I'll just chill here for a bit. Radiation. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a radiation guy. So if Mike isn't online anymore, what the hell is he doing? I don't know. He could be doing anything. He could be eating something. He could be... Uploading the stream to YouTube? I think doing anything like why won't it blow up how many regular hits does it take Come on. Because, like, you have to be able to not beat this part with bombs, right? Because I don't have any bombs, so, like, this has to work, right? Does anybody know? Am I just screwed? through it. I mean, I can try. Nope. Don't let it scroll off screen. It might reset the hit count. Oh, that's a good point. Thank you. Gonna be here for a while. Can I go back for bombs? I don't know. I don't know, um, I mean, I might have to. If anyone who's played this before knows, please let me know what the deal is with this. Yeah, I will go back to Vampire Survivors because they added some more stuff, so I should check it out. <sighs> See, and now it probably reset because I accidentally let off stream. Screen. I'm going to see if I can get more bombs somewhere. Well, <sighs> then I'm probably going to die getting hit by something. Huh, let's see. I reset. Oh, I reset it. So that was the problem. Shit. So, I mean, maybe I just need to do this level again and- oh, he comes back though. Oh, I got a bomb. Okay, at least that helped a little.
Okay, and now everything's black and white, and we're gonna have to fight these guys again. Oh, I have four bombs now! I have four bombs all of a sudden. Oh, shit! This is hard. I can't heal. There's no way to heal. Oh, you mean to... S Damn it. That's right. I just stay still. Well, that was a learning experience. I thought it was just going to give me one bomb, but I guess when you get that B, it just gives you like five. At least it uses a short password. That is right. d graphics uh, I don't want to get that I feel like oh no See, now I'm just going to die. Because, yeah, we got to start over. Every time I got to do that because I die in a stupid way on this part. <sighs> so aggravating. Is this the ship or is the character laying horizontal? I think he's laying horizontal. He's got his ass out in the air on his little rocket ship. I'm not gonna try to get that E because every time I do it, well, should I try it? I should try, no, I'm gonna die if I get it. But I'll get this one. The continues are unlimited, then why start over? Because it starts you from the very beginning of uh, the level. So this is the beginning of level two. And it looks kind of the same as the beginning of level one. So the level is just extremely long. These little fuckers. Fuck! Whatever, we're far enough, I'll just suck it up. So that's what that plus does, it eliminates everything on screen. I guess before when I was getting it, there was nothing on screen. So it was like a waste. If only they had those, can I get up there really fast? Oh, I did it! I did it. What's the tail? I think it's just the end of the ship. And now it controls itself, and I stretch, and my wrists crack really loud, and it's very unsettling. You are now entering the Air Fortress. This is the Air Fortress from hell. So far, so good, Telly. Yeah, he's riding the ship, and then now he left his ship behind, and he just has a little 
blaster. Maybe hold them close to the mic. You want to hear my wrists? I don't. I don't know. It might gross some people out. Some people get grossed out by cracking bones. <laughs> Why wasn't this at Blockbuster? I'm sure it was. Fuck. Get, get off me. Mm. Alright. Uh, trying to kill father, no brain. <laughs> this part sucks. Go. Go. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay. Alright, that was kind of cool. It's the first time I was able to do that. But, no, going stuck to the bottom. Oh, didn't get hit though. <sighs> this is very happy music for a fortress. Why do you think it should be more intense and like in like serious sounding I like that it's not super oh shit I accidentally used a bomb oh well we got it back I like that the music's kind of uplifting and cute because it makes it a little less stressful hello Alaskan hybrid Get up there. <sighs> See, isn't this a long level? This is like Castlevania 4 status long level where it just keeps going on and on. Hello, Richard. Shit. Ugh. At least I have a lot of bombs. All games should be as stressful as possible, don't you think? No. Of course, some stress. No, I don't want to go back up. Ugh. Because you need to have some challenge, but not everything has to be super stressful. Oh, God. Took so many hits there. Just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. Got hit in the face. <laughs> Who made all these mad robots? Hmm. 
Was it Dr. Wiley? Was it Dracula? I don't know. Dr. Claw, like mad agents. Dr. Claw is in space. And that must mean Inspector Gadget's in space. Why won't he help me out? Oh, shit. I actually wasted that bomb and now we gotta do it this way. There we go. Alright. This sucks. This part sucks. Shit. Ah. Uh. No bombs. So is this what you'd call a cute em up? No, because it's not like a shmup. Get out of the fortress! Ah! Alright, I gotta pay attention. I'll look at the chat in a bit. After I die. Now we're going to have to fight the other guy again, and he's probably going to kill me. Thank you so much Alex Jetson for subscribing for four months thank you all right so now we gotta do all of this again but now the lights flicker and it we're like we're all gonna die every time I die right there every time it's like I can't make it there with enough health this is so annoying. So I guess there I need to remember to like try to recharge a bit or something. Try again, NES games are hard, that is true. Pop in Castlevania 3, Sifo won't let you go. No, this is Air Fortress time. All right, let's try it again. <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice if the password like would put you where you died? I don't even know where you'd put the password. Reset. Hold on. I'm going the wrong way. Oh, really? So I'm choosing because in that part where there's two pipes, I'm supposed to go through the left pipe and not the right pipe. Is that where you're talking about? I'm gonna see what he says. So I was going the wrong way. Or do you mean... Oh, 
I think you might literally be going through the same way twice because I was wondering about that. Well, if someone would care to elaborate, that would be awesome. But we'll try the other pipe, I guess. Why well, won't it let me go down? There we go. Gotta press select to go down. He was so sick of Aaron's playthrough, he left. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so now we have to enter this again. I think that was an I. <sighs> I eight T A. Going to the right pipe will take you back to where you just were. Oh, well, the other pipe takes you to your ship. Well, I'm dumb. Okay, thank you for explaining that. I should have cut on to that, but. Let's try it again. Yeah, now maybe I can get further. So at least we learned something, right? <laughs> What's TA? I keep people saying, hearing, seeing, so they're talking about something TA, I don't know what you're referring to. Teacher's assistant? Oh, the password you're talking about? One eight TA. I'm confused. Yeah, TNA is something else that is not in Air Fortress. At least not yet, anyway. Maybe there'll be some TNA eventually. to get this. Getting better as you memorize it, yeah. I mean, that's true. With all the repetition, at least it's sinking into my noggin. TNA surf design. Total non-stop action, that's right. I saw someone say, do you read any books? I do. I'm still reading Meet Me in the Bathroom, which is a, a book about um, the New York City garage rock scene of the early 2000s. It's really long. Um, and then I forgot to finish Britney Spears' autobiography. I had like a little bit left. It's a really short book. And I just forgot to finish it. I need to finish that. All 
I see Jeanette McCurdy has a book out. I read some of it. Like, I didn't watch iCarly because I was, like, after my time, kind of, for, like, Nickelodeon shows. But it just sounded interesting. It was, it's pretty depressing. <laughs> like, she had a shitty, like, stage mom. It's really, it's, it's an interesting read. The guy's name in this game is Hell Bailman. I read the manual. Hell Bailman. So we're Hell. I'm not gonna call him Hell. He is Craft Punk. Maybe Hell is a reference to 2001 A Space Odyssey. I never saw that because I'm uncultured trash. But I usually get the references because I know of the movie. <laughs> Thank you, Telly. <laughs> You saw TMNT 2, Secret of the Ooze, so that makes up for it. Thank you. I was just joking. I was making a joke. But thank you guys. So you know where to go now? I think we'll see if I'm understanding correctly. I think I was picking the wrong pipe to go down. Go in there. So I need to go down this pipe. Right? Let's find out. Only escape. Well, how do I get in there? I don't get it. I did beat the first level. So I have to go right first? Okay. You have to go the other way, blow up the reactor, then you go this way. Okay.
first level, you never get to see the escape pod caged up. Yeah, because I was like, well, what? Like, what? Shit. I'm just gonna die because I don't want to waste all of Alright. Gotta rest. Yeah, I, I forget to do that. But it's like at a certain point, you're so low on E, it's like, I don't know. Too hard to. I'm afraid I'll die if I get those. That's why I pass those up. Yeah, I don't think it's impossible. It's just figuring out what you need to do. This would have been a good rental back in the day. Hello, K Train. It's really important to get those E's during the flying portion. It determines your health bank for the ground portion. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Well, maybe I should try harder to get those next time. Good to know, though. Rest a bit, okay. I'm paying more attention now to that. The music is a jam. I do like the music. I haven't gotten tired of it yet. Um, the gray blocks, you can't shoot. 
Like maybe you can use a bomb there, but I tried using a regular one and it didn't work. But you can shoot the blue blocks in that part that you're talking about. Shit. Ah. The music sounds so victorious. It does. Oh, you do need a bomb to shoot the gray box? Okay. Gray boxes. Fuck. Going down. Trying to take it slow. Okay, so I go to the right first. Right? Yeah. And then apparently we'll find the part where I go backwards for some reason and not go backwards this time. That's the goal. Let's see if it can work. You'll get it this run? I hope so. Really? Shit. Okay, so instead of going that way, I turn back and go to the right. Like I go backwards. Hello, Officer Boogle. No. Okay, so I guess I don't understand where I'm going wrong. See, there's only one pipe to go to. I don't... So is this right? I keep going in this pipe? Keep going. Okay. So I guess I'm... I don't know. See, all this looks like the same shit again. So I feel like I'm doing something wrong again.
Oh, here. Okay. So now I go in this pipe. Okay. I see. If I could get some energy, that would be awesome. Fuck. Yay! We did it! There we go! Finally! Now I understand. My brain just wasn't thinking with the pipe part. <sighs> now we are approaching the third air fortress. Twenty five percent done. <laughs> I don't get why those things go. Level two is the real tutorial. Now shit gets real. Ugh, I'm nervous. Fuck. I mean, shit is getting real. Oh, well, there is no enemies there. Oh, well. Good luck. <laughs> I'll need it. Thank you. Shit! That's okay. At least it was at the beginning of the stage. Alright. Things fly really fast. Shit, 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 shit. Oh my god! This gets crazy! Wow. Alright. Those little squares projectiles, those are like the worst. Does this game tie into the Kirby universe? I don't know, good question.
KA91 is a password. Okay, well, thank you, Hex. <sighs> Shit, I like fly right into those. Fuck. I'm not playing good anymore. Not that I ever was tonight. <laughs> Hello, Bad Bobby. Hello, White Wine Sipper. Thank you for the bits. Hope you're doing well. hit there I always get hit at that first wave of the like cubes <laughs> mm -hmm. oh thank you classic Mike oh that was close Everything in this game is harder than it looks because you move so slow. Yeah, I guess you do move pretty slow. Oh, that was close. Alright. I think we've made it to the fortress! that thing. That looks terrifying. A little orb. It is a good soundtrack. game starts being criminally hard by later levels. The way you lose life by flying, shooting, walking, etc. adds up so quick. Wipe the smudge off his glasses? That's a reflection. Only escape 
Oh. Let's see, do they go the wrong way again? Oh my god, look at that little robot. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many things. Oh my god, I'm moving so slow. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. This is on NES. Oh god. Um, we got something there. Top 10 cutest NES robots. He was pretty cute, but he kicked my ass a bit. Oh my god. Really? Okay, I guess I'll kill this one first. Oh shit, shit, shit. Okay, there. Don't forget to stop pressing the D-pad to charge. I'm trying to remember. Oh god. Okay, so now I go backwards. I'm guessing. I'm worried I'm gonna choose the wrong way to go because I'm so bad with directions. Uh, oh god. Uh, this way? Maybe I go this way. I think I go this way. Because we went this way the first time and it wasn't the right way, so I'm gonna go this way. Or wait, am I doing the wrong thing? I don't know. Yeah, I was right. Yeah. Yay! That was surprising. Um, I just stream and make videos. Yay! Thanks, guys. Wow. Okay. Now, now I'm like, what's the next stage gonna ha hold for us? I'm nervous. Biggest trick to know in this game is that you move fastest when you shoot backwards, but this takes some life. Okay. <laughs> I think I know what you mean. Oh shit, like how am I supposed to do that? Maybe I can go backwards? Oh, I can't shoot. Uh, shit. Well, I'll probably die anyway, so we'll try it again next time. Uh. Oh! I hate those! I hate those! Let's try this again. We're good, Suave Chris. How are you? Ugh.
See, like, how am I supposed to shoot that fast enough? Oh, I guess like that. That's not too bad, actually. game where the clear where the clear the screen screen power up actually is useful I'm looking at you Castlevania exactly that's what I was thinking be glad you're playing the North American version the Japanese ver version I uh, you die in the shooter stage you gotta start from the beginning oh wow I pressed the wrong button. Oh well. Keep. I pressed the bomb button. Shit, 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 shit. Go. Alright. Let's go. Just go. Go. Fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, we need to get out of here. We just took so many hits. Oh my god. Try shooting backwards to move faster when you get a chance? I'm not sure what you mean. Like... I don't get it. Shooting backwards. Oh, by pressing up? Game Genie to beat the game. Mm. I mean, I didn't realize it. I mean, I had a feeling it was gonna be tough, but I didn't know really what I was getting into. But I like it, it's fun. You can do it in the air too? Okay. Like that. So we went the wrong way, but I guess I'll kill these guys because I think they don't respawn. Fuck. So now we gotta figure out where we're supposed to go. Is this like a secret? So, 
I'm going backwards because I guess I chose the wrong path at some point. Hello, evil minded. So I'm a bit confused as to where I'm supposed to be going. See, this is a dead end. Like, what am I supposed to do? This is the escape, so I'm doing the right thing now. No. Okay. This is the escape route. So I guess I do go up the elevator all the way. Let's try this. Oh, I can keep going up. Okay. I didn't realize how many floors there were. Okay, I don't think we went up this far before. Top 10 elevators part two. <laughs> there definitely are a lot of elevators in this game. Okay, so now that I did that reactor, now I gotta try to remember where I went in the first place, or wait. I don't know, I am so lost now. Hello, Delta Falcon. Yeah, this is my first time really playing this game. Do I go this way? No. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Okay. I know I need energy, but I don't know where to find energy. Let's see, do I keep going up? I don't know. So I'm afraid to fuck around when I have such little energy left, you know? see where we're going. Well, this isn't good. Oh god, oh god. Shh. Well, that's a tough stage. We'll try it again. Oh, 
Oh, we just missed that. Good first run though, blind. Thank you. It makes you want to keep trying. It does. This Japanese version is a lot harder. Hold on, I'll read it in a second. If you die during the flying stage, you have to go all the way back to the beginning. That sucks. So in some rooms, the pipe in leads to somewhere else when you go back. In this level, the pipe sends you somewhere else so you can't plan on backtracking. Okay. So it's kind of just like a, you just got to hope you're going the right way. Shit, I didn't see that stupid rock looks like part of the background. <sighs> I'm so frustrated. I'm sorry I'm quiet I'm just I'm trying to pay attention here not get hit yeah this is my first time playing it Fuckers. Mm. Getting burned out. So you're gonna become an air fortress expert, Aaron? Wouldn't that be funny? Out of all games. <laughs> I doubt it. I'm nowhere close to being an air fortress expert at the moment. Ah, oh, shit. These are bombs. Great. Hello, Eldo. 
Are my hands holding up okay? I probably can't play too much longer, but I'm trying. I'm trying to keep going. We are now finally in the fourth air fortress. And it's kicking my ass. So it's like, should I just go all the way down? Or should I get off on each level? I don't know. I got further than you did. I mean, this is tough. Shit, 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 okay. Uh. Just get out of here, just get out of here. That is tough. Are the blinking things on the bottom pulling you down? Yeah, the pink things on the bottom, those kind of suck you down. Good to play this game on parts, just get the password. Yeah, I'm glad there's passwords. Now I go all the way up. There's so many levels, it's stressing me out because there's so many ways to go. You know? Ah, shit, I used a bomb. Oh well. you hex i'm glad you're liking the stream i'm kind of like is this a good stream is it just a mess i i can't tell <laughs> okay let me kill these things first Okay, so now it's just I gotta figure out where the hell to go. Thank you, Nina. Alright. These fuckers. So now I just gotta guess what floor to get off on and try to find the way out. Um, hmm, I guess we'll go this way. Can I not go that way? Oh, that was a wall. I couldn't tell. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god. And then when do we go up or down? It's like, I don't know. <sighs> down? I should have went down. Everyone's saying go down. Okay, so when we get back in the elevator, we're going down. Uh oh, the lights are going out. 
I'm just gonna keep going down. Hey, Beery Swine. Okay, this is as far down as we can go. Let's try to get the fuck out of here. I'm guessing it's gonna blow up at some point if we don't make it out. Ah! Did I die? Did I not make it out in time? Is that what happened? <laughs> it was one last stop down. Oh, I thought that was the last stop. Well, shit. I'll give it one more attempt and then I'm going to probably have to stop. Maybe try to ignore the L. Yeah, you only get 120 seconds to escape after you blow up the core. Oh, okay, I was wondering. I was like, this has to be timed, right? All right. One last attempt for the night. Air Fortress 4. I'm gonna die because since I died so fast. See, you're at four, you're doing good. Well, thank you. I thought I was dying at the same point at level two because I ran out of uh, E energy. Not because of time. Well, now I know. <sighs> you need a oh god Invincibility power up is nice, yeah. It does help a little bit, for sure. Okay. See, it's like I don't remember where I'm supposed to go. I think I just... Like, was I supposed to go all the way down here? I don't... left okay so it is left okay I appreciate the help because it's like I just don't do well in games where it's like a giant maze <laughs> I there's no hope for me in games like that not my strong point no go up there No! <laughs> this 
So now I get hit by all these things like crazy. Try to get out of here as fast as I can. I'm not sure, easy, let's go. All right, so now I think this is where I go all the way up. And after this, I gotta haul ass to the end. So now I have to hurry. So I think I go. Should I should no. Um, I think I go up all the way here. Shit, do I? I'm trying to think. Or is it, no, it's left here, right? Hmm. I'm gonna go left, I feel like it's left here. Hello, Lenny. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, now I have to go over here and I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just trying to get out of here now. Okay, now is it here I go all the way up, I think? Or is it all the way down? Shit, I don't remember. Down, it's down. Oh god, it's down. It's down. We're gonna run out of time again. Fuck. Yeah, we're gonna die. If we go any faster... Then I go right here. Well, I have to go right. Oh, I go up and then right. Go, go, go. Same thing. Oh my goodness. Well, this is quite difficult. What do y'all think the market would be for new tube TV, specifically for classic gaming? I really don't know. It seems like a, like there's there's obviously an interest in where people want a CRT for gaming, right? But I don't know if there's enough of a demand for it where they would ever produce them, you know? Like it seems like a lot of people will want it, but on, but in re reality, it's like probably not that many people understand or care, you know? 
It's a bit too niche, exactly. It's like, you know, it's not the most obscure thing, obviously, but it's like, it's not mainstream enough, I don't think, to make a profit. Thank you so much, Resburgu, for subscribing for 31 whole months. Damn, thank you so much. LG made a CRT recently, but it was only in Japan. Really? That's interesting. I want to look that up. Hello, Spinzig. These little paper airplanes. Oh god. Ah! Those things always get me, but I was dodging them. Like, the last two attempts, I think I dodged them. That was cool. Because last stream, those were just destroying me. was defeating. How good are you at making paper airplanes? I don't know. I, uh, I've never really thought about it. <laughs> I like this part. It gives you a break to just do, to get some water. You have eight CRTs? Yeah, we, we have a lot. Right now, I'm not using one because of my setup, but we do have multiple CRTs in this house, as of course we would, right? <laughs> it is good to have backups because you never know if one will not be repairable, if it breaks, or, you know, you need, the, you need to start hoarding them because so you'll have one if one dies, you'll have a backup. That's how I think about things. Like, since I was a kid, it's like, oh, I need a double for this. Or like, like, what if something happens to blah, 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 I need a backup. Maybe it's just my crippling anxiety, I don't know. I just always assume, like, oh god, something bad might happen, you gotta have a backup. Alright, let's get out of here. Ugh, I don't like this part. Go! Why aren't you going? asshole. You asshole. Backup plans are comforting. They are. That's like how I I mean, I know I've told the story probably a lot, but like when I convinced my mom, oh my god, the super butterfly. When like super Nintendos were really old and Toys R Us had a bunch of the smaller, you know, I did a video on it, the like small super Nintendos for like, they were $25. And I convinced her to get me one because I'm like, I love the Super Nintendo. She's like, you have one. I'm like, yes, but one day what if it breaks and I'm going to want one forever. And then she bought it for me. And I'm so glad she did because I still have both. <laughs> but my first Super Nintendo is still working. Thank God my N64 doesn't work. My childhood N64 is busted. So that's really sad. But my Super Nintendo works. Hello, Jose. Good to see you. So do we think in about 20 to 30 years, there will really be no functioning CRTs left? I don't know. There's people that are like really into repairs and modding them and stuff. So I think there'll always be somebody that can fix them or create something like it. Like, I don't think there'll be no CRTs. You know what I mean? There are working tube TVs from the 40s. Yeah, exactly. So I, I think they'll be okay. Because, like I said, there's people that are, like, dedicated to, like, preserving, you know, tube, t tube TVs and stuff. So I think we'll be okay. They're, they're smarter than me. I don't know how any of that works. What if Nintendo 64s don't work anymore? That would be a shame. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That's why emulation, you know, it's kind of important because it preserves it. Because it's not like Nintendo gives a shit. Is Mike being attacked by Elmo? I don't know. He's streaming though, so maybe you could t tune in and find out.
best we could hope for is if Nintendo's an N64 Classic Mini. Yeah, that would be nice. I wonder what games they put on it. Everyone would want GoldenEye, which you know won't be on there because it's like licensed. It would be a miracle if that was on there. Alright, so we got we got a haul ass now. Oh good, we got another bomb. Come on, Aaron, you can do this, maybe. This is feeling shorter because now I kind of know what to do. And then I know you want me to go backwards, right? Oh, it's so hard. It's like my brain won't wrap around it. I'm so sorry. Let me go, you stupid. Okay, down, two, one, two hoo! I'm like the owl from the Tootsie Pop commercial. No, 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 don't go up. Why are you going up? I didn't mean to press up. I am so- this is not gonna happen. This is not gonna happen. Come on, where are you, creepy man? Yeah, that's right. There's gonna be another creepy man. Yeah, that's right. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. The suspense! Shoot backwards, Aaron. I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Why aren't you going up? We did it! 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 Yes! I am so happy. We finally did it. Alright, now we are on to the fifth air fortress! Yay! Alright, here we go. Let's see what this is like. I'm a little nervous because people are like, it gets really hard, and I'm like, but it's already kind of really hard. I should have got that E up there. Well, here's some. Whew. Ah! No! I'm gonna write that down. Hold on, I gotta write a note for myself really quick before I forget. What's the timestamp? Around 5940. Because I might edit this down, because or else this will be like a forever stream. Okay. Oh shit! I thought that was in the background! It got me again. I've been better with those clusters, but oh god, we gotta go up here. We're missing all the E's. Great. Great! Awesome! Oh my god, I hate these things. Leave me alone! Oh my god, that's a new thing! I would like some power-ups, please. Give me a bomb or something. Like, the invincibility thing's alright, but it would be more helpful if I could get some energy or a bomb. Fuck you. <laughs> this is- okay, now it's getting- it's getting a little tough. Oh, this is stage 5, what a horrible level. Hey, little mixer, so you know what I'm talking about then. So you've played this. Does it get a lot worse? This is my last attempt for the night. And this level is kicking my ass. You got stuck on this level forever? Okay, well that makes me feel better. So I'm not just horrible at this. Like, it is hard, okay. <laughs> my god, it's just, it's like the part before you actually get to the air fortress is just, it's so long. 
I feel like it just goes on and on, and then when you get in the Air Fortress, it's just... The way they place... It's like... How do I explain this? It's the same enemies that have been in every single level so far, right? But the way they place them in this level, it's like... It's... It's tough. It gets so much worse here. <laughs> Well, we'll see what happens. We'll see how far I get. You are never just horrible in any of these games. Well, thank you. <laughs> mm. Oh my goodness, thank you so much, Dango, for some for gifting five subs. Thank you so much. You gifted one to Sassykins, to Konopolis, to Zelda's dad, and to the King of Hades. So if you got a gift sub from Dangolin Pangolin, I hope I'm saying your name, username right, please tell him thank you. Thank you so much. That was so nice of you. And if I don't, if I die before I make it to the Air Fortress, I'll try again. So it's basically one more attempt in the Air Fortress, is what I'm saying. Oh! Ugh. No! Okay, see, we'll, we'll start again, because I want to at least get in the Air Fortress. Yeah, one more good attempt. Exactly, Domino's. Here we go! Intense. I feel like this would be a good game for Mike to stream. He would enjoy its toughness. This is kind of making me want to try Metal Storm again. Is it's like the same kind of vibe to me, like with the difficulty and everything. I still can't believe I don't have, I did, see that was before I had Aaron plays extras. I wish I had the recordings. Cause like I got to the last boss in Metal Storm, but never beat it. Damn! Okay, we made it to the Air Fortress, so this is our last attempt for the night. I don't know if I'll- I don't know. Maybe I'll come back to this. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Hello, who watches the watch? Welcome to the stream. Currently on my last attempt for the night. Thank you, Dominoes. Alright. Here we go. We are in the Air Fortress from Hell. Thank you, little mixer. Can we get this little fucker? Okay, I didn't expect it to end that fast, but I, I gotta stop. I don't want to kill my hands. So, um... 
I don't know. I don't know if I'll come back to this. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Because I do need to play Shantae. I, even though this level kicked my ass getting to stage five, it is still really fun. Like, I still really like this game. So, um, yeah, I recommend it. If you want a game that's fun, it's hard, but in a way where you want to keep trying. So I like it. I like Air Fortress. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for hanging out. This has been a really fun stream and I'll be back again soon. Probably with Shantae and Game Boy Color, but we'll see. Maybe I'll want to give this one more attempt, but I need to... I need to start on that next video. All right, guys, have a really good night. Bye.